Hi, welcome to our home. Hi, I'm Cindy Merritt and I'm your local real estate partner. And just like you, I live, work, and play in the Richmond, Virginia area and all around our wonderful surrounding counties. It's November. We're all getting ready for the wonderful month of giving thanks. And what better place to do that than one of the places where we celebrate the very first Thanksgiving. We are in Virginia's historic Berkeley Plantation, and we're gonna take a look all around at their Thanksgiving Fest and find out what the first Thanksgiving was really all about. So we are with some historic characters down here at Berkeley Plantation. Tell me who you are and what you're representing today. Well, I'm Mr. Tomlin, and I'm one of the militia. Our job, of course, is to protect the rest of the people that are on the ship that are landing. I'm Ferdinando Yates. I'm the journalist, basically. I journaled the entire trip. Very interesting. Thank you, guys. Love Thank it. You. Thank you. We are so excited to be here with Graham Woodleaf. Um, Graham, you've got a real connection to Berkeley Plantation, don't you? I sure do. T tell me what it is. Well, in 1619, on December the 4th, Captain John Woodleaf, mm -hmm. who was in charge of a, a crew coming over here, landed at Berkeley Plantation and held the first official English Thanksgiving on that day. But before they came, the Berkeley Company, who were the four gentlemen who started the expedition, told them when they got here, you should pray for your safe voyage and do it perpetually and annually. So they, that's what they did. When they got here, they held a Thanksgiving praying for their safe voyage. And they did that for the several years after that, as long as the settlement existed. So the Woodleaf started coming in 1958, and it evolved in what you see today with all these people here uh, for the first Thanksgiving. It's Into been a this, wonderful experience. It is this wonderful, basically a reenactment or recreation of the first Thanksgiving. Exactly, and we reenact the first Thanksgiving. Uh, every uh, year when we have this, mm -hmm. at 3 o'clock in the afternoon, there's a reenactment. So we were following the orders they had back in the beginning, saying, give thanks perpetually and annually. We have done that since 1958 uh, here at Berkeley. Wonderful. And the Jameson family has been wonderful, allowing us to come and be a part of this, letting us use their land for this wonderful event. And we want to teach people about the first Thanksgiving, what it means to America and what it means to the state of Virginia. It was just so special. And it was truly the first Thanksgiving two years before the Pilgrims landed in Plymouth. Wonderful. Now, what is your relation to John Woodley? Uh, I'm about ten grandpas removed from John <laughs> okay. Woodley. All but, right. Uh, it's, uh, so you are living history right here with us. Definitely a direct descendant. <laughs> wonderful, yes. wonderful. Well, we so appreciate you letting us come out here and partake in all of this today. Isn't that a beautiful day? It's a gorgeous day, and we really appreciate it. Good. Thank you, Thank Graham. you so much, Cindy. Appreciate it nice so much. You. Nice to see okay. you. This home started its construction in 1721 and finished in 1726, so you're going to find dated bricks between that time frame. So I'd highly recommend looking around the riverfront entrance for those bricks. Now, we have a lot of beautiful furniture throughout this home, all dating between the 18th and the 19th century. None of it, unfortunately, survived from the Harrison family, but we do have some period pieces that they could have sat in at other plantations. The Virginia Thanksgiving Fest out here at Berkeley Plantation is so much fun. There are demonstrations and crafts and authentic uh, people in costume uh, all over, so it is a great place to bring your family. So as you are preparing this month for your Thanksgiving, Remember the first Thanksgiving down here at Berkeley Plantation. Come on down and make yourself at home and give thanks for the turkey legs. Mmm, that is good. Cindy Merritt is nationally recognized as a leader in the U.S. real estate market. Of the more than 35,000 realtors in Virginia, the American Institute of Real Estate Professionals consistently ranks Cindy in the top 10 best realtors in the state. Make Yourself at Home is sponsored in part by Paul Adams, branch manager and nationally recognized senior loan officer with Prime Lending, a Plains Capital company. 
With over 400 mortgage options available, Paul Adams and his team work hard to uncover the key to each client's mortgage success.